can't remember any other specific instances, but I remember being very frightened a lot of school. Yes. Well, also of, part of, of getting that, yeah. questions wrong. Yeah. And I was very rebellious, funnily enough. I, I, I mean, not what you'd call rebellious nowadays, but at the time it was. I mean, like I hated the sports so mm. much that I was never picked for any team because I was never good enough. And you were sent to watch the sport, even if you weren't playing. It was freezing damn cold, you mm. know, in Yorkshire in November or whatever. Yeah, wow. And we found where the music teacher kept the key to the double bass cupboard. Um, and so myself and a friend, who was on hate being cold, used to get ourselves locked in the double bass cupboard. So, <laughs> so, so when the prefects went round the school to chuck everybody out that yeah, were hiding, because yeah, yeah. we tried hiding in the toilets and that never so worked. So you'd rather they be always... locked in a cupboard than be outside the cold. <laughs> <laughs> and... Um, I mean, there was all hell to play when we got caught for doing yeah. that. And, oh, I, I playing tennis, I'd knock the ball into the, the boys' school next door so that I didn't have to play tennis anymore. Wow. I mean, I remember... There was definitely a defiant part that, of you, wasn't there? Yeah, that, I was thinking about that. So there was, because I, I remember getting this report that said I'd done very well to have come top of the year, but it was a bit of a shame that I'd also got more detentions than any other <laughs> child. <laughs> I want to encourage the part of you got the detentions yeah, to come out of it. And, and I was thinking, because actually I did, you know, and, and and I was sent to guides and I, oh, yeah, be guides. I hated it. I got thrown out of that for smoking with the scouts around the back. That was more interesting than having to listen to this woman, whoever she was, telling you how to do it or not. <laughs> so th th there was so definitely... So, so there is a place th in So you. there was, I mean, the thing is, it was what? squashed out a lot by because I couldn't be rebellious at home. Yeah. But I, I don't think I had any respect for the teachers I had at all. What, if you were to name that part of you, what name would you give? What would you call it? I call it Red, actually. Red, yeah. What would Red have to say about life now? She'd be saying, oh, for God's sake, come on, get out there. Right, yeah. What have you been doing the last 10 years? Yeah, because she's got some life force, right? Mm. She's not going to be told to, to have white wine when she wants red wine. No. no. She's not going to be dragged out of the theatre when she wants to sit and process mm -hmm. the last couple of hours for a few minutes. She's got, she's got some guts. You've got some guts. <laughs> How does it feel to recognise that? It, it's mixed again. It feels good and it feels sad and it feels wonderful and it feels a whole... Yeah. Jumble yeah. stuff. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a bit of me, I think, has been lost for a long time. It feels yeah. like, sorry, I'm covering okay. up the microphone again. <laughs> we, sorry, we guys. Won't, we won't put your microphone on your heart next time. <laughs> no, the heart needs to get on my sleeve. <laughs> what, what does Red have to say? I kind of about... wear a red jumper or something. Right. And you wanted red wine. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what does Red have to say? about how you approach the next few weeks. She wants to say, come on, you come on, girl, you can do it. And what does she want you to do? Just be you, be you, you really are. Just, mm. just be that person that can respect herself, really, I think. Yeah. And stand up for herself. Yeah, yeah. Let her make some mistakes. Yeah, and that, that's, that's the difficulty. It's make, and it's not make so much making mistakes. It's, it's, it's yeah, making mistakes in relationships, I think. Mm. So there's probably no accident that, you know, lived on my own all this time, so it's safer. Yeah. And when Red got caught trying to hide behind the bike shed, she didn't give up. She thought, I'll try the cupboard of the double bases next time. <laughs> so she's yeah. also got some tenacity as yeah. well. Yeah. Yeah. 